everyone, today I thought I'd do a next haul video because we got some vouchers for Lucas's birthday and had a little spree so I thought I'd share with you what we bought um, I'll start off with Lucas's clothes um, I had this for Lucas last Christmas in obviously a smaller size but really loved it and saw it in the sale so picked this up I haven't taken it out of the packaging because of the fact that I sort of want to keep it neat and dust free ready for Christmas but I absolutely love Elf and decided that I could not not let him have the t-shirt again and it was only £5 in the sale so I thought that was a bargain um, we also got some next socks for him they look absolutely huge for they're meant to be 12 to 18 months but i'm sure lucas's feet aren't like that that big that's quite that's quite big he's only a two and a half at the moment i'm not sure if that actually says on here what sizing no it just this goes goes in ages but he'll grow into them i'm sure but I just really like them. I love the little grey and black sort of design. Um, probably one of my favourite purchases for clothes wise for Lucas is these. They've got little braces and they're like a plum coloured chino trousers. Trouser? Trousers? Trousers? Trouser. Um, they've got little turn ups. But I just think they're absolutely adorable. I'm wandering around. Disney in August I think he's going to look really cute with that with like a little t-shirt on underneath because he's cute um, and then last things for clothes wise for Lucas we didn't spend too much money on clothes for him because he has quite a lot anyway were these they're a pack of three and they were £13 but you just get the plain white one that's got sort of a grey dip dye I guess Om ombre can you call clothes ombre like a dip dye sort of bottom so it goes white to grey he's got like a duck egg blue sort of t-shirt and a grey and white striped t-shirt which we also got in 12 to 18 months because he's not quite into 12 to 18 months yet though those trousers the t-shirts will probably be all right but the trousers are going to be absolutely huge on them for him because he seems to be really tall but really skinny sort of like brad um he hasn't got my unfortunate figure luckily um if i got like i've got some home bits as well because one of our friends actually put money on a voucher and said it was for Lucas and us. He didn't want to just sort of pay for a voucher for everything for Lucas because he knew Lucas was going to get a lot anyway. So with it, we did buy uh, like a, it's a class of the laundry bag with this geometric sort of print on it. But it's going to be used as a toy box to go in our lounge because colour wise it matches the lounge really well and Lucas has got so many toys for his birthday that we're running out of room but I just thought it was so sweet and for £10 you really can't go wrong and it's bigger than what I thought it was going to be and it's really wide so that's really cool um, not that we needed any more but I absolutely loved these there's some mugs Ooh. and I just thought it'd be nice for Brad and I to sit and have our tea and when we finally get when we get breakfast together which is like twice three times a week maximum really so I thought when we have breakfast together we can sit with our cups at the table and feel like a cute couple because I guess it's nice to feel cute <laughs> either way I just love them there were some cushions with that pattern on as well but they were they were reversible, but they were twelve pounds each. For so for me to get two of the reversible ones, 
it would have cost £24. I thought it was quite a lot of money to spend on cushions. Um, next, we... I've got a bit of an obsession at the moment with canvases. I love inspirational quotes on canvases or in frames. And Lucas has got quite a few different sort of prints in his room. So when I saw this, it was a bit confusing. Um, before I show you, I'll just let you know. If you were interested in buying this one, if you go onto their sale, it's classed as £7. If you go onto the full price bit, it's still on sale for 20 But it's exactly the same. There's no difference, no difference in sizing or anything. I'm not really too sure what's gone on with that. But if you would like to buy it, I would suggest going onto the clearance section and finding it there. Because if you do, if you search it, um, it will just come up as £20. You won't find the £7 one. But we managed to obviously find it for £7. And I don't know if I'm going to be able to get it all on camera. But. I'm hoping you can actually see it. It just says dream big. But I just thought it was really sweet. And it's probably going to put it, I don't know. I haven't decided if we're going to put it in the lounge, diner, dining room bit, or in our hallway, or our landing. I haven't decided yet. I'm sure that's something I will sit and have a really massive think about before Brad starts putting nails in the wall. And then our final purchase is probably my favourite homeware purchase. And this was slightly on the more pricier side. And this was £25, but actually when I saw it, it's a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. I didn't really look at the measurements. I just saw it, and because if I was paying, if we were paying for it, we probably would have been been a bit more careful. But because we knew that it was a gift that we could just sort of spoil ourselves, or something that we probably wouldn't have purchased with like our wages, if that makes sense. Because it was a voucher and it was a gift, we knew that we could buy something slightly more special that sort of was a lot was nice, really. So. When I saw this for £25, I thought it was really lovely. And it says, one small positive thought in the morning can change your whole day. And for someone like me, he can be quite negative and can worry and get quite anxious. I thought this would be quite nice. Whether I'll actually follow it or if I'll just put it, look at it and go, that's a nice quote, is something else. But... I just love the pinks and the sort of watercolour sort of effect and I love a bit of rose goldy copper coloured foil writing. I thought it was really sweet. So that's sort of everything. We spent £85. Um, obviously the majority of that was on Lucas's stuff and then a little bit of it on, was on ours. But, yeah, it was nice to be able to treat ourselves as well as treating Lucas. So, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope I have inspired you to either go and buy some inspirational quotes. If you don't like to spend next prices, I'm sure you'll find an Etsy print for cheap. And then you can go out and buy just a cheap frame. Etsy full of inspirational quotes that are easy just to if you've got a printer it's cheap as chips for you you can even make them yourself um or if i didn't i didn't say this but you can steal them off of google images and then just print them off and frame them yourself and it'll save you a fortune but if not then next is got some really lovely ones and i know that most mums and people i've most i think most people enjoy next shopping for either kids or homeware so i hope You'll have a lovely shopping spree soon, somewhere or another. So yeah, thanks again for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, um, leave a comment, or you can. I'll leave my so, like social networking links in the info box below, and maybe you'll give me a little follow on there as well. So yeah, thanks again for watching, and 